Welcome to Manic Mondays with Mickey and her co-host and partner in crime, Gail. Not just Gail anymore. Today's episode is the episode number seven, and our date is December 16th. Welcome to the show, everybody. Put on your antlers, grab your hot chocolate, let's do a little lip sync and talk some meow. All right, here we go. It it cut out on me, completely cut out on me, people. What is with that? It just cut out at me and said, select a song. What is with that? What is with that? I'm just saying. Can you actually hear me on? Oh, oh, I'm, I'm losing it. Okay, well, I feel like not the Queen of Sheba. I feel like the Reindeer Queen. <laughs> the Reindeer Queen. Excuse me while I knock you out of the picture. Not that you're even in the picture. What? She's not even in the picture. I know, I have this boring backdrop. It's driving me bonkers. I love I love that it's a nice backdrop, but you know, I almost like my the kitchen cabinets behind me instead. I, I do. I know, it's like... So let's remember everybody that that it is, if you don't remember, it's Christmas time! Again? It's a uh, manic time. I mean, you can't find a more manic time than Christmas time. What am Wait, I doing? Sound effect. Uh, sound effect, ready? Oh, I'm losing my clothes, hold on. <laughs> my, my cape is flying. The, the reindeer are running and I'm having to try and keep up and it's not working. My, my. I'm Dasher, I'm Dancer, I'm Vixen and Nixon and Cupid and Comet and Daughter and Blitzen. And Rudolph. <gasps> Where's my flashing nose? <laughs> I should have my flashing nose on. I'm just saying. Even though this is a vodcast, not a podcast. Podcast, you can't see me. <laughs> that would be half the fun. I'm just saying. Okay, there's times when it gets boring and you're like, <clears throat> so don't. I got a friend and uh, and it's her birthday. It's her for all of you that have a birthday today. Happy birthday! You know who that was. Come on, think Christmas. Come on, grass off my hat. The weird dentist. No, it's the abominable snowman. You're getting closer. Happy birthday! Snowman. I started to sound like South Park there for a second. Whoops! I wasn't, I wasn't talking like the little brown guy. Sorry. He's a big fat. Okay, wait, wait. It's, it's happy birthday! Every time he puts his hat on. Oh, for God's sake, it's frosty. Oh, I said snowman. You said abominable snowman. Well, then I said There's snowman. a difference. <laughs> you see what I put up with. Do you see? See, if you were live with us at 7 o'clock, you could be part of this insanity. Everybody's like, no, I don't, you won't see me. I don't have to see you. Just post your comments. And one of us should be able to see that. Okay, listen, if you, what? Just trying to see where it is in the lag world. I want to try it in the live world. Lag. She, oh, lag. she's looking in the lag, lag world. world. Let's see if we do this. This will. Oh, that's kind of cute. Oh yeah, that's kind of. That's the reindeer nose. What do you mean that's kind of what? 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 Reindeer antlers nose. The nose. She. <laughs> I'm trying to, you know, I'm thinking PG here. I'm actually, I'm thinking rated G and she's obviously not. <laughs> and I'm not getting it because I'm not. What? I'm not saying what? anything. Somebody type in there what they see. I'm seeing reindeer. Okay, this is what I'm thinking is reindeer. Reindeer. Okay, I'm trying to imagine what she's seeing. I'm not getting it. I see eyeballs right here. And antlers and a nose. Eyelashes are here and a nose. I'm not looking anywhere else. Oh, see, she's gonna point this out later. I'm gonna go, what? <laughs> kind of like the upside down mask. The only episode not changing saying it. gender. <laughs> uh, 
So, we're here to talk about what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. Okay. Well, that's okay. We're going to leave it there anyway. If it makes you laugh even better, it makes you laugh even better. My flipping cat. Okay. So, for those of you that don't know, I live in an RV. And my screen door has been challenged lately by the wind many times and the cats and life we'll just say life has challenged my screen door and uh i started letting the cats out again thanks to gail putting a fence around my rv and uh so the dog has got a, a place to run and the cats are going oh i can go outside without that other dog attacking me Woohoo! However, she still keeps them in line. It's really cool. <laughs> they'll sit there on the step or, or on the, 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 and you've seen them. They'll just sit there or they'll lay there. And as soon as they see her, they're like, okay, inside. <laughs> I'm going inside now. <laughs> okay. So he's gotten, Simba has gotten in habit of going out again, even if it's a little bit. See, now you've got me so self-conscious about this nose. <laughs> the the reindeer nose. But I think I'm going to leave it there. So, so... So, uh, the night before last, uh, well, uh, last night, I, was it, when did you take that dang door off? Was that today? Yesterday. Was it yesterday? Yeah. Okay. Well, the night before that, I had, that wasn't me. Was that me? Yes, that was me. Get up. No, some, somebody's ha ha Uh, <laughs> That was probably me like five minutes ago. Right, I know. Yeah, the leg. It's all about the leg. Anyway, the cat's laying there, and, and he's decided, oh, I had to put the cat box in front of the door when I went to bed, because the night before that, the little jackknob decided, what? Nothing, I'm just... She's looking at the computer, the big box computer. Let me show you. Let me... Jesus, something in the way. The, the big... See? I'm over there, too. And it's the super leg is going on, so she's like... Anyway, anyway, I put, anyway. <laughs> what? <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> Speaking of cats. Oh, man, I'm losing it again. What in the world? What? I don't resemble a tree? <laughs> Come on. I just, oh, I tried to knock myself out there. Okay, my cape. Red and purple. Isn't that the red hat women that wear red and purple? I think they wear red. I know they wear red. Lots of red. Okay, so back to the cat. Manic, uh, he decides he's going to go. Oh, wait, the wind ripped my screen completely out of my hands. Tore, no, it didn't tear. It broke the latch off that holds it to the main door. So that when you open the door, it's not going, you know, and clanging and driving crazy. That broke. Well, the seam, I've needed to re-seam the screen on there, but you know, at the horses come first. Everything for the horses comes first, and then the ranch comes second, and then the trailer comes third, and oh dear God. So, 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 he decides he's going to put his paw up there, grab on with his little claws, and do this. So now, because it's not attached to the door, because the latch is broken, it's going knock, 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 knock. He waits till I get into bed to do this. He woke me up three different times knocking on the door. He thought this was funny. I'm gonna kill him. I thought I was gonna kill him. I love animals, but I'm gonna kill you. I would, I would. Where, where's all these music thingies you got? You, you should have seen her. She was going nuts with music. I was sitting here rocking out. Where'd all your, your music thingies go to? In the folder on the <laughs> OMG. <laughs> See, I got to teach her how to be, when she's listening to the things I'm saying, when is it appropriate to start certain things? He's like, what? Speaking of that. that. Yeah, <laughs> this is, we're talking about things that are animals, crazy things our animals do that we want to shoot them for. Yeah, see, we need to, the jungle, we, we're gonna get better at the music thing, when to play what and get clips and all that. But you know, we just don't have that much time right now, so we're working on it. Uh, the this crazy cat, he loves this this blanket I brought over. 
it's like, look, check out this bike. This is one I had at the store. And he thinks that is his, period, cut and dry. So he acts like he's all calm and sweet. Look at him, he's like, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Hi, buddy. <laughs> he's not, oh, he's the nicest. Hi. Oh, what a sweet little kitty. Watch his paws, the claws are already coming out. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Do you see those fangs? Those fangs, those crazy little fangs. Look at his eyes, guys. I'm telling you. Wacky. He goes from cross-eyed to straight-eyed to cross-eyed to straight-eyed to cross-eyed. I know he sees two and three of everything. I know he does. What's your craziest story of him? That'd you know, be really hard to, like, pick one. <laughs> what did you say? What was? What does he do? He gets... I mean, he acts so loving when you're in your chair. He just comes right up and he, he lays right here. He, licks, he used to lick my nostrils, but he stopped that, thank goodness. <laughs> you were telling me how you were chasing him through the house one night. What did he do? Well, he gets in vengeful mode. If I move him on the bed when he's sleeping, he seems to think that uh, I, shouldn't, I shouldn't be able to move the blanket, so he wakes up. <laughs> And he probably does everything he knows he's not supposed to do, like jump up behind the TV and chew the wires. Oh my God! And then I have to get up and go get him down while he's looking at me going, ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> and then I'll get back in bed, and if I don't get him up the second time he does it, then he'll come over and very nicely bite me. <laughs> come on. And then yeah, he will it's... do that two or three times till I get mad enough to go chase him, and then we'll run from one end of the trailer to the other. <laughs> I can just see where he running. passes me and grabs my leg and bites it. <laughs> and he doesn't. I mean, he draws blood. He's crazy. He's yeah. crazy. He's crazy. He, I mean, Loki. it's like <laughs> right. His name is Loki. Loki, the crazy cat. Okay, so I gotta fix this here so I can see the little eyes again. I can't wait for you to point out what you're seeing later, but I'm not even gonna go there. All right, so <clears throat> yeah, crazy. Oh, and he likes cat. lemons. He likes lemon. What cat likes lemons? That one. That one. <laughs> <laughs> he is a and huge, tomatoes. And tomatoes. He is a weird cat. Weird, weird cat. I left my glasses there. I can't see diddly squat all up. He's a weirdo. You know, they took away my mask, and now that it's live, I can't choose one to add in. You can only choose one, and they won't let you add another one. Lemon? She cut a lemon. Let's see now, if he'll probably. do it. Probably. Lemon? Lemon? Ooh, lemon. Oh, no. You know, cats, they take 10,000 times longer than we do to decide. What? Here, let me help you. Hurry. <laughs> Just set it there. There you go. You did oh, finish my banana, banana this morning. You finished your banana? Yeah. Catch your weirdo. Okay, well, if I catch him licking it, we'll, we'll point that out. Crazy cat antics. So look, even if this isn't live, which I can tell you're not here, so because you're not there, I can't see you. And if you are, then, well, Facebook's lying to me, and, well, that's normal. So uh, just anytime, put in... Put in the craziest antics in the comments. Put in the craziest antics that you can remember where your cat or your dog or your horse drove you absolutely bonkers. You wanted to, I'm gonna kill you. But you know I'm gonna kill you, but, but you're really not gonna kill him. Then again, I chased Nakoma. He kicked at me, I was up against the fence, feeding time. The crate, is it going there? Maybe it's too overripe for <laughs> The lemon is too overripe for the cat. <laughs> what have we decided, Scott? Oh, he's going to clean himself instead. Okay, well, here, let me move it for you. Well, he likes the idea of these bells, let me tell you. Bells. Loki, the crazy cat. Okay. <laughs> He's getting... 
<laughs> uh, we've, we've both had some crazy things happen with our animals before. I mean, the, my cat's as big as they are. They're, I mean, friggin' Musaba. He's like, <laughs> he's huge. He's on a diet, by the way. I, no more filling that dish and just leaving it till it's full. He's not free feeding anymore. <laughs> I cover the bottom of the dish. I put it out there. I try to let Simba get some first. They get that three times a day, once in the morning, afternoon, and night. That's it. He's going to lose some weight, little chunk. He's a chunk. In your spare time, right? In my spare time. You know, speaking of spare time, I did not get on the computer today until here. And now I've got it open and I don't even know why. Everybody probably thinks you're dead. I'm right. <laughs> Nikki, where's Nikki? Where? I don't know. Or, or you know, the other side of that is she doesn't like us anymore. She doesn't like me anymore. She said she'd get a hold of me. She said she sent me this. She said she'd do that. She said she. Jesus Christ! I work seven days a week for God's sake. I'm always on there for you guys all the time, 24 hours a freaking day. Welcome to my manic Monday. I took today off. It was very difficult. It was really difficult. And I didn't sleep the whole day. What did I do? I watched them. I, I, I took a nap. I did take a nap. That was right before I went and fed. Oh, I have got this cart. Oh, M, L. It's a new one. Oh my Lord. Oh my Lord. So I don't offend anybody. They even thought that was pretty cool at the Southern Baptist Church when I went for bread today. That is so cool that they do that bread. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, every Monday between 9 a.m. and 12 p.m., they give out free bread. And it's not cheap bread, kids. This is not joke bread. This is not cheap bread. This is, I mean, this is some top-notch breads, plural, all types, bagels and uh, uh, English, muffins. English muffins and and hot dog buns and hamburger buns and heat them rolls and I mean they got I mean they're just fantastic I go in and I donate five bucks and instead of going to one of the stores in town here I, I the cat is playing I oh well excuse me <laughs> oh here he goes okay we're gonna stop this story for a second there he goes crazy gecko with his favorite blanket we don't know why oh Oh, don't look at there. Oh, oh. Get it. Gonna get your foot instead. That'd be good. <laughs> See? He's a weirdo. He's gonna get bad. At oh! Oh! <laughs> He's gonna kick himself in the head. And then get mad at his foot because he kicked it. His foot kicked him in the head. How dare we? He's a goof. He is a crazy cat. Oh. <laughs> Are you gonna get mad at your foot again? Yes, no, maybe so. You can't decide. See, that's that's the problem with this cat. You can't decide. There, you can still see him that way. We'll have cat cam going on. <laughs> it's the cat cam. So I'll just leave it there so they don't have to look at me. They can look at him if they want to uh, while we're talking. Um. Southern Baptist Church, they, I, you know, I don't go to the Southern Baptist Church, but I do go in and instead of paying $3 for a junky loaf of bread at our local stores in Golden Valley, little stores, I'm, I'm grateful for the little stores, don't get me wrong, I am, but I can't stand that brand of bread that they put in both of them, it just drives, I've tried it, it just kills me, so I just go without, I buy tortillas, I don't even like them, forget it. And then I found out about these guys, and and then uh, <laughs> and uh, look, he's looking. He's like, "What's that up there? Are you watching me?" Oh, yes, I'm watching you. Yeah, I remember the first time I went over there, they had uh, uh, art, freaking Sara Lee artisan bread. I was like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> I haven't seen any since. But they had pumpkin Thompson's Thompson's limited edition pumpkin spice. What are they called? You just said it a minute ago. English muffins. Yeah, those English muffins. <laughs> yeah, and, and they always take, take as much as you want. <laughs> Put some in your freezer. I'm like, I need a freezer. <laughs> don't have a freezer. Sorry. 
Yeah, awesome, awesome, awesome. I went over and checked out their clothes. They got a free clothes section. It's like a little thrift store with nothing but clothing, clothing and hats. And uh, ah, it was it was. Tr I love thrift stores with a passion. Well, you saw everything I got today. Mm -hmm. And if you bring it home and it doesn't fit, take it back. <laughs> it's a donation. <laughs> don't even need a receipt. No receipt needed, and they never care. They will always give you a return. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome. Yeah, really neat people over there. That's that's the Southern Baptist Church in Golden Valley. Well, you're gonna act like you're just not crazy because you are. You are. He's saving it up for bedtime. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Well, we can't have that. Yes, go after that. <laughs> He's like, what? What are you doing? Wow. <laughs> and there you have it. It doesn't take that much to drive him bonkers. Because he's already there. Crazy cat. Yes, you are. Cra ah! Crazy cat. Well, the blanket stop. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid blanket. <laughs> head inside, grabbed on, and shook. Get it, buddy. Get it. Oh, there he goes. He's insane. Dangerous cat. Most people would be like, oh my god, he's nuts. I couldn't keep him. He scratched me to death. I can't tell you the scars Gail has on her body from this, this cat. And she loves him. She teases him. It is too funny. She'd be like, well, it's okay. He can, he can bite and chew on the pom-poms on my on my slippers, he just can't grab on and bite my foot. Well, okay. <laughs> you can play as long as you don't lose control, cat. Okay. Well, people seem to think animals don't have a memory. Oh, they do. He has a very good memory <laughs> for grudges because <laughs> if you make him mad, oh, say in the morning and you're walking around outside in shorts, he will <laughs> dive bomb by you and grab you and bite you and scratch you and then look at you like, ha ha, gotcha. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's like, why are you talking about me? Why, why exactly? You think that's bad? Wait till tonight. You're screwed. <laughs> He'd be fun to do one of those little, the pet application that Donna did with the chihuahua. Yeah. He would be so good to do one of those with. That would be hilarious. Yeah, I don't quite know. <laughs> I like that. See, now Kara... I love her so much. She's so sweet. Everybody loves her. She's, she's just a doll. And then I go in and I forgot to pick up the bag of trash. It's hanging on the deal, on the on the thing. And I get back from bread and hunting for cigarettes for you. Oh, for God's sake, don't go to try to buy your cigarettes if you don't have your ID on you. God forbid you just run down to the store. I don't care if you're 65. Don't do it because they are going to make you pull an ID out. You know what? Get a grip. I'm glad I don't smoke. Oh, my God. That was redundant. I'm like, I don't care. She goes, <laughs> she goes, you got your ID? I said, no. You don't, you're driving? I said, I didn't say I was driving. <laughs> <laughs> However, I know my license number. You can't do that. Yes, I can. All they got to do is pull up your license number, and they've got it right there on the screen. They all have screens. It's not a big deal. They'll give you a ticket for that. No, they haven't. Now that I've said it, watch what happens if I forget my license. Yeah, I have the Geico app where I can just have my <laughs> oh, insurance card on my phone, but it's like, yeah, I'll hit a dead spot somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> I have insurance, really, but it doesn't work. <laughs> you need to take a screenshot of that so it's in your gallery. <clears throat> I do the old, I just yeah. print them and put them in the glove box. <laughs> Well, that's a good idea, too. <laughs> I forgot I had my license on my phone. I forgot all about it. So I do have it, but I don't want to lose it. I lose shit, man. I just lose stuff terribly, so I'm not going there. Hey, no sleeping. You be <laughs> I just see his third eye. His third eye was totally covering his eyeballs. He's like, don't wake me up. <laughs> you, wake up. Wake up. Wake up, crazy gato. I know, uh... You're gonna pay for that. <laughs> <laughs> You're the one that's gonna have to pay for it, not me. I don't, I don't have to sleep with his booty. He's glaring at you. Is he? Well, here, let's make him happy. Here, let's... Whoa! <laughs> he doesn't like Santa, does he? <laughs> oh, Santa Claus! Okay, don't ruin it. We gotta put him on the horses. Can you imagine? We're gonna have a videotape. 
What? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Santa, he's going to kick Santa's butt. Sir, now you're a Santa kitty. There's a Santa, look at those claws. It's like a freaking saber tooth tiger in mini form. Give me that tank! <laughs> He appreciates what we're doing. <laughs> oh my I god. Don't, I don't know. She, what about the hat? Oh, I got the hat on. <laughs> <laughs> you just put the hat over. Is it? Oh, we gotta try it. See, now I gotta try it. If I can do this without him drawing blood. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Here, buddy. Are you ready? Don't mind my fingers sticking out, so it's like in the way. Are you ready? There you go. Now, let's see what happens. B and I know he can get it right off of there. <laughs> Bless his little heart. Oh no. Oh, okay. See, he's, he's like, you do that to me again, you're dead man. I'm taking your flesh with me, woman. <laughs> I'm watching, watching the TV. It's funny watching her go. Yep. <laughs> he's like, yeah, I love it. Look, he grabs on. That is so cool. Yeah, we are going to have no watchers for this video except for that because I am just spaced. Are you, do you feel spaced out today? I don't know. I've been throwing mortar under a bathtub and oh my God, picking it up right. and in and out 35 times. That's insane. That's picking, putting mortar under your bathtub. She's putting in a new tub. It's a whirlpool tub and she is bound to determine this thing's going to be working like ASA freaking P. I'm just saying. Yeah, I got it. Or maybe in the spring <laughs> and the whole mortar thing threw me off it's like ah, how do I do that well you managed to use that kitchen spoon just fine <laughs> <laughs> well, see they, they, they in the video they were putting the mortar down and then you know people are picking the tub up and setting it down so I was like huh okay <laughs> I have to figure out how to do this they and were I picking the tub up and setting it down. I'm guessing there were like more than one person. Yes. There. Yes. You, on the other hand, are one person. Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> so with my twin, when I can pull my twin out of my pocket. <laughs> see, even though I'm afraid to move this, even though we'll put it there so you can see my ears. Even though we'll catch the we catch, Even though well, that was three times I said it. <laughs> Even, there's no place like home. There's no place like home. Even though <coughs> there's just two bodies living here, we have many more people living here. Yes. Figure it out. Two bodies, many people. Figure it out. I'm just saying. It's not just Gail anymore. No, it's not. <laughs> it's not Gail, just Gail. We didn't even cut. What is your, what did you, what's your name tonight? <clears throat> Cattail Gale. <laughs> well, we could have said Kitty Tail Gale. <laughs> I think we'll go with Cattail Gale. Yeah, that's more, that's more me. That, that is more you. We might want to stay there almost. What's the funniest thing that... Oh, no, yeah. Yep. The funniest thing you could think... Or the most, the most, oh my God, you did not kind of moment with Ruger. <laughs> Ruger's Ruger. Yeah. His, his, his uh, <clears throat> falling in love with Mona, maybe. <laughs> back when he, back when when he got he out? Was, he was a boy toy. <laughs> when he got out. Uh -huh, yeah. That was funny. That was funny. Mona is, for those of you that don't know, Mona is about an 1,100 pound Tennessee walker. Is that about right? Well, she's fat. Only her belly. Only her belly. She's a bloatation device. Just say it. <laughs> she is a bloatation device. Okay. So that's that's Mona. Yeah, that's my Tennessee Walker. And yes, I said my Tennessee Walker. <gasps> she just said she had a horse. They're all mine. Get over it. Well, they are. I'm their godmom. I will always be their godmother. Always. Doesn't mean they don't work. I'm getting defensive again, aren't I? Mm -hmm. And nobody said a word. No. Sorry. <laughs> Mona and, okay, now Ruger is a little black, appy, 
And when I say little, he's a mini. So he's little. How tall is he? I have not measured him. I need to get your measuring stick out. Oh, we've got 29, maybe, maybe 30. 30 hands? Inches. <laughs> <laughs> my, my measuring stick is a hands, a horse hands. Yeah, it shows hands, how tall in hands. And he's, boy, if you put him, in, well, Mona is what, about 15-ish? 15 and a half. Okay. And he's probably yeah. like six and a half, seven. He can walk under her belly. <laughs> yeah. And she's got a big belly. It, she's, just, she's just a big belly. Um, yeah. That's why she doesn't get anything but grass. Big belly. But God, she's comfy. You still have to go out and ride her. Before the rain. <laughs> Talk about animal antics. So before little mister got fixed, right, with, he got fixed right, I don't know, two weeks after I moved over here, he, she got him fixed. But before that, he was like, yeah, I'm all that and 10 bags of chips, yeah. But it didn't sound, Bruh. it was, <laughs> he sounded like, he sounds like he was on helium. I'm like, oh my God. He was like, <laughs> I think I still have it on my phone too. <laughs> yeah. You remember? I was like, oh, I gotta get this on recording. <laughs> and when he saw Mona, he was like, oh, yo, big girl, come see me. <laughs> but she kind of liked him too. She so. did. She did. She's, I'm telling you, she's been bread made for. She's just, she's a hussy. She is a hussy. Oh. Somebody is here. That would be, that would be, that would be, I know that horse. Speaking of black horses, that, that horse icon you're seeing, I know it's over there, is uh, Jules. Hey, Jules. Uh, good to see you. We were just talking about horse antics, because, um, you know, animal mania and Gail's little mini Ruger and how he's like six and a half hands tall, but he thinks my Mona is like, Mwah. especially before he got fixed. So, yeah, it was kind of cute seeing this itty bitty little mini with this and they were both going, oh, oh, I love short men. And she's going, oh, he's he's doing the e, oh, oh, I love you, you're so big. We talked about how we were gonna, how funny it would be to, to build a ramp for him so that he could actually go there. You know, it's kind of like a chihuahua with a freaking great name. <laughs> that's, that's pretty much it. And he's sleeping again. Told you. He's, no. He saves it till bedtime. No, now. no, 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 wake up. Wake up. It's because it gets dark at four o'clock. <laughs> this cat goes from zero to a thousand in a matter of moments. I mean, see, there he goes already. He's already eating it. <laughs> He's, he will be popping his head through the center any moment. <laughs> no doubt in it. <laughs> now, um, I don't know. I think with Ruger, when we're talking about Ruger, I think Einstein. Oh, dear Lord. If <laughs> Okay, so Einstein is, for those of you that don't know, Einstein, and we're, we're keeping the camera on the cat in case he goes bonkers. He might explode anymore. He might. You never know. And that's why we're waiting. I don't want to move the camera from the cat. So it's, and he's actually, oh, aren't you just being all... Nice and... <laughs> Aww. Aren't you cute? If I keep going with, oh, aren't you cute? He's probably going to go bonk. Hi, cutie. Aren't you adorable? He's going to be like, woman, I am going to kick your butt. I'm going to scratch your butt. Man, you're behaving. Yeah, he's going to, he'll blow any moment. <laughs> I, when Einstein, the, the our pot belly pig, He's a sanctuary animal here. He was, long story, he was left behind and his brothers and sisters found a home and he didn't, so he is at home. And he's become a best bud of mine. He was over, he's not fixed. He will be, he's not. <laughs> he was next to the minis and <clears throat> it was amazing. They were all playing kissy face every day, but him and Ruger, oh my goodness, they buddied up. Ruger was fixed at this point. However, the pig is not. <laughs> I was able to let him out. Up to, so I'm surprised I, I was able to let him out and have him follow me out there with the minis and all that for as long, considering how old he already is. So that's, I mean, he's over here. Testosterone bomb. Yeah. Man, when it hit, it freaking exploded. <laughs> 
So he's like 50 to 75 pounds, which will be for him will be a max. He's full grown. And he decided one day, instead of following mom, he was going to run after Ruger. And Ruger stood there. And the pig thought he was tall enough to do what he needed to do. We just, we didn't think, I mean, he hadn't gone with the, you know, with all the action of it yet. So we, I didn't think much of it. They were kind of playing tag. They were playing tag, yeah. Yeah, and then, then he just kind of Velcroed his front feet to Ruger's back. <laughs> you, you have to understand, yes, the pig, that's how small Ruger is. So Ruger, as you know, being his six, six and a half hands tall, he's, he's standing there for some reason putting up with it. We have no idea why. We're standing over on the side going, just kick him for God's sake. Push him off. I mean, the pig's going to run away. He's not going to get kicked. He's, he's quick. He's smart. <laughs> However, he decided he was going to be a mini horse and he was going against them. Oh, when that cracked me up. Ruger started walking away, and I'll be dang if that pig didn't walk with him on his back two feet. Oh, I thought I was going to die laughing. I didn't plan on having to go in there and hold him by the front of the head to keep him from making fun with me, too. Well, initially, we would want to try and video it because it was funny it, until it got a little... <laughs> Ruger's, like, running, and the pig's <laughs> running behind him. <laughs> talk about me right now. I'm trying to keep him from falling asleep so he won't drive you crazy, but I don't think that's going to work. Anyway, yeah, Ruger was running, running, you know, his little... <laughs> He's so... They're so cute. Here, we got to get right... Let him watch me. He's watching me. What? He looks up at that, and then he looks down at me. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Yeah, that was... Yeah, so then I went in to intervene, and I got his attention. <laughs> Lucky for me, I can get him to calm down, because he was frothing. He was just, I mean, it looked like he just, I don't know, like he like he bit into a can of whipped cream or, or, or uh, you know, uh, shaving cream or something. I mean, he would just, yeah, insane acid breath. <laughs> he was worked up, let me tell you. And yeah, he thought, okay, mom's here. Ah, no. I remember holding the phone. I got it videoed. I got that part all videoed. And I'm holding the phone videotaping him. And I've got my hand on his forehead. And it's like, calm down, calm down. And in my head, I'm thinking, oh my God, he's going to attack me. Yes. <laughs> please don't hit me with your tusks. Please, please don't do that. Ah. Yeah. But I was so glad I got him to lay down. I mean, if I didn't have that, that bond with him that we managed to get. Wow, I finally got him calmed down to lay down and then I got him back out of there and back into his area. Wow. I'm very careful with him now. And yeah, now he's in love with his mailbox. Now he look. It's not a mailbox. It does look like a mailbox, doesn't it? <laughs> it does. It's a cat. Back to cats again. It's, it's a cat. It's a plastic cat tree. Oh, Jules. <laughs> That's where I got that from. When I was over at Jules' place, um, um, the young lady she's got there in the in the RV, the uh, I'm drawing a blank. Um, she had it and asked me if I wanted it, and I said, "Yeah, I'll take it. I'll put it outside for the cats. I can always hide in it if they get chased." Well, now <laughs> the cats don't use it, so I put it in for the pig to play with. And he rolls it all over the place. He'll stand it up and then he'll throw it. He loves putting it in his pool. <laughs> what is with that? I take it out. He puts it back in. I want it in the pool. Don't take it out. Okay. Yeah. And every now and then, he loves his cat tree. <laughs> and as long as he's loving the cat tree and not me, we're good. I'm just saying. Maybe it's a genetic thing with pigs, because the one pig that I had when I decided I'm not going to raise pigs anymore got my goofy horse when he was laying down. He trotted up to him and climbed up on him. <laughs> like, oh, and oh, dear! 
Well, he tried to go after Kara. Remember, they were playing at first, yeah. and Kara was smart enough to go circles and run. And then I had to, luckily, I can open the door because now when he did that, they were in the fenced area, you know, with the RV. So I could open the door to the RV and say, Kara, in, and she did. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the door. I know if he could figure out how to climb that thing, he'd try to go in that RV. I know he would. Oh, yeah. I'd be would. screwed. Well, he had the mailbox, the cat tree next to the <laughs> fence one day. And I swear he was figuring out how he could get up on it to get over the fence. <laughs> that's what he was doing. He'd get it there and stand on it, and then like, like. <laughs> he falls. And then he'd slip because it's plastic. <laughs> Thankfully, oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah. He's playing with the rest of the walls. Did you see? He's laying on. Okay, so uh, Maria Treston gave him um, an old playhouse, a plastic playhouse that her granddaughter used to play with. Well, she's obviously, well, now she's too, she's too old to be playing with it anymore. So she gave it, she said, hey, maybe he can use this. And it worked out fantastic. Well, <laughs> now that we're, we're over here, the setup we've got, I took it apart. Oh, oh, he got too big for it. He got too big, he got like 10 inches too long for it. He, <laughs> he, was, he kept going under, lifting it up, trying to move it. And it was just <laughs> dipping over. So that wasn't working very well. So I took it apart. We got him some cover and now I'm using, I took one of the walls and put it to the side to make him another wall for now. It's makeshift, but it works great. So all the other walls are laying for him to play with. That was you. I know. What? Oh, oh, oh. Huh? Huh? Emily Steele Black. Emily, she posted it in King and whatever. I didn't see the rest of it. Oh. So, uh, yeah, so he's laying on the part, the wall that's got the hole in it for the window. He was over there laying on it, and there's nothing in that hole. I mean, it's like three inches deep. I'm going to have to take some of that grass out to him. Anytime all the grass that goes on the ground after feeding, uh, when I'm packing nets, Bags. Or the wind is blowing. Really yes, or large. the wind is blowing everywhere. So when I'm cleaning it, yeah, when we're cleaning up the hay from from outside, not in the horses, uh, it doesn't matter what's in there. There could be rocks and dirt. It's no big deal. I give that to him for bedding, and so he's got lots of grass in there right now. Yay! Is very happy. Well, and there's some some little bit of dirt on the side of the bales that were just brought over to us. Um, from Mojave Valley. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Samantha. You're amazing. Appreciate you a ton So that was cool. So I can just take those and even you know, even though it's just a little bit dirty It's not a big deal. Just take that and give that to him. So I was able to take that and throw it in Throw it in with him. And boy, he just moves that stuff everywhere. He thinks that's the greatest. He's got his bed in there He comes walking out and he's just covered in grass <laughs> He's like, yes, those pretty brown eyes of his Teaching him to stay now. So, all right, we're at 45 minutes. I think we need to have a song and, and close out for the night. We're gonna go a little less than our big crazy hour. We're just gonna bring it down a little bit. What are we playing? It would be live. Speaking of cats. Oh, let's do it. Sure, let's do it. Name that tune. I like it. Watching the cat. ready to blow up, isn't he? <laughs> Look, we even have... Yep. Did I mention how he likes to be beat? Spotted with a fly slaughter. <laughs> he actually likes it. Ha.
He couldn't care less. All right. On that note, <laughs> we're out of here. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where is he? Where? There he is. Where is he? There he is. Oh, Lord, he's on the table. Get off that table. Get off the table. Off the table. Off the table. Off the table. He likes it. He's annoyed. <laughs> You guys have a good one. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Enjoy Christmas. Watch it. <laughs>